Most of the effort to explain it involves games of blame. Uh, right now we're all aware that the Republicans blame the Democrats and vice versa in an endless chorus uh, that begins to sound the same after the 14th speech uh, by whoever's looking for a job promotion in whichever party. Um, and then the blame goes beyond that. Uh, people on the left like to blame bankers, people on the right like to blame poor people who take out loans, uh, so forth and so on. I want to break from all of that. I want us to acknowledge that in this economic system that we have, which has a name, it's called capitalism, uh, there are a set of rules and that most people, because they really can't avoid it, play by those rules. Bankers make loans in order to make money. Corporations do what they do in order to make money because that's what the people who make decisions in corporations are hired to do. And working people try to have a job that's decent and try to earn an income. And if they can't do what they think they ought to do as good citizens, as good parents, with the jobs and incomes they have, well, then they borrow money. And that works out real well because the banks are real eager to lend it to them. And we have everybody perform pretty much the way they are supposed to. When a society has people who are all playing by the rules and can show you that that's what they're doing and the end result is the kind of disaster we have, then it isn't any more appropriate to blame this or that actor. It's time to recognize that the system of rules is the problem. Everybody's playing by the rules, everybody hopes that will all work out, but it doesn't. In my profession of economics, we have a great philosopher with which all economics courses begin. His name is Adam Smith, and he's famous for the following line. If everybody pursues his or her own self-interest, it'll work out for the best for everybody. Most of you know that that's silly. It's a wonderful rationale to go out there and do what you want for yourself and not care about anybody else, but where that leads is exactly where we are in a very, very bad crisis.